On the bench here we have a 2005 Ford Mustang instrument cluster. Customer said all the games quit. So let's get right into it. The lens is held together by five clips. Fairly simple, just pop them loose. I like to use a pair of tweezers to take the, the needles off. As you could see, they are pretty bad. Let's see what it sounds like. Looks like none of them work. Just get up under there with the tweezers and come right off. If you use a fork, uh, there's a chance that you will break this uh, black plastic off of the needle because just the way it's designed. So the tweezers get right under there without a problem. These instrument clusters fail because of these faulty motors. Uh, they're fairly easy to replace. Just gotta desolder. Each motor has four points. Just gotta desolder them and pull the motor out and pop in new ones. Okay, let me go get the new ones. buy these you want to buy the ones that say x27 on them x27 589 see the old faulty ones are the xc5 589 so to desolder these we like to use a desoldering gun this makes the job a lot easier
as you can see, the desoldering gun makes the job a lot easier. Uh, in just a, just a minute or so, I got them all desoldered. Make sure you desolder them all the way and uh, before attempting to remove the mortar as it could damage the traces if you don't get it desoldered properly. be a little bit tricky just kind of got to work it out so as you can see they were all desoldered properly none of the traces were lifted we see a lot where people will not desolder them properly and when they pull off the mortar it will pick up this trace and that can be pretty tricky to repair so make sure you get it desoldered properly Make sure the pins are straight before installing them. Before soldering the motors in, make sure all four pins are sticking out on this side. And then just solder them in. Fairly simple task. Uh, just heat, apply the solder, hold, let go. Perfect solder joints every time. Heat, apply the solder, let go. Heat, apply the solder, hold, let go. Heat, apply the solder, hold, let go. Just like that, we got 
got those all soldered in. It's ready to be put back together. To calibrate the needles, instead of using the tape and marker method, I like to just power it up and uh, install the needle onto the zero point. A lot more precise like this. This one's kind of touching the fascia, so I'm going to pick it up just a little bit. That looks good. All the gauges sweep. This one's ready to go. I'm gonna go clean up the lens a little bit and get it reinserted. Get that push button back in there and This one's ready to go. Have a 2005 Ford Mustang with gauge issues and you'd like to send me your cluster for repair, uh, feel free to send me a personal message through YouTube or visit our website. I will have a link below. There you could purchase a, a mail and repair service that has all the instructions of what you need to do to send it in. Thanks for watching and have a great day.